Hey y'all, my name is Sarah Elmars and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be doing a lip swatch video on the Essence Long Lasting Lipsticks that I was technically supposed to do when I was doing Brand of the Month and Essence was the Brand of the Month and I never finished it, right? I think some of the clips I didn't pay attention and I wasn't recording of when I showed like either me showing the lipstick or me putting on the lipstick. I wasn't paying attention. Look, I was like kind of watching a video a song was playing I learned that fish have like natural suction cups so I'm I, I, I don't know um not all fish but there's some fish that's just, that just suction go ahead and enjoy the video while I take this lipstick off you know to make matters even worse I'm now looking back at the footage a week later I didn't even film the first lipstick I didn't I did I did I didn't, I didn't film me putting on the first lipstick and showing you guys the swatch. Uh, I think I might go take a nap. I, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what to do anymore. So a couple things that I actually do want to say about these lipsticks is for one, I know this is kind of ish normal, but I'm kind of tired of like when brands don't have like the sticker on the lipstick matches the actual lipstick because those lighter shades was just, it just didn't make any sense. Like the lighter shades, I expect them to be darker because of the sticker on the outside, but the darker shades, they pretty much came through. Um, surprisingly, this is the first time I didn't really care for the red in a lipstick collection or just like a lip collection because I love me some reds. Girl, I love me red, but uh, I don't care for it. And I literally just took it off right now. Oh, the lip gloss I'm wearing is from Essence Fire Lip Gloss. It says wet look definitely looks wet. Um, but I mean, for the price that you're paying for the lipsticks, which I literally don't remember how much I paid for them, 
you probably seen it on the screen or I'll probably leave it on the screen now how much they cost but um they're pretty cheap so it's like I can't expect too much they are very creamy um if you are someone who's going to wear these under masks which I don't see why you would wear a full-on color lip product that is not completely matte um under a mask because that's going to go all over the place um if you are, just wear a, like a liquid lipstick and it's not gonna move. I mean, they're fine, but like no one's really into like cream stuff, you know? It's like matte is making a resurgence. So yeah, but I just wanted to tell y'all, they're, they're actually not that bad. The color payoff is actually really good on all of them. Even on the lighter shades, the color payoff I feel is good, except for one of them. I feel like it's a little bit transparent. Um, but yeah, I don't know, that was it. That was my thoughts on, on it. Usually I don't talk in my lip swatch videos, but I mean, hey, why not? Anyways, that is it for this video. If you liked it, please give it a like and also comment down below. Have you tried these Essence lipsticks? Um, what are your thoughts if you have tried them? Was there a color that you liked on me? <laughs> the darker shades, I like the darker shades. The red was fine, but I like the deeper berry shades a little bit more. And if you are subscribed, please click that notification bell so you get notified every time I post. And if you are not subscribed, please do because we're trying to get to 2000 before the year is over. Okay. And also make sure you turn on the notifications so that we could get that up. There's like 178 of y'all that have like all the notifications on. So if y'all could all just be like, hey, let's just, woo, let's more y'all. That'd be great. All right. I'm going to go. Bye.